Kentucky, you got somebody to tell you where to be, what time you should go to sleep, what time you got to eat. Like, it's always like you're living by an alarm clock. Now it's like I only hear one alarm clock. It's to get up in the morning and like put the work in to do it. It's all about breaking barriers. Like if you can keep on breaking them eventually, you're going to be one of the top players. Like you got the greats, you got like the LeBrons, you got the Kobe's, like they seen themselves change. Your body's just making your money. My goal coming in was like to gain 20 pounds and put five inches on my vertical. In high school, you was working out with a dude that was, you know, pushing you like, well, you didn't think you can go anymore. And then you get to college and they're pushing you to another level. There's always something that you can push through or something that's not gonna stop you from getting where you wanna go. When they finish their season and you know, they move out here, they, they meet with the nutritionist, they go through our full scans with the therapist and the strength and power side. And we really create a roadmap for them. You know, with a guy like Willie, he's got so much talent. But at the end of the day, when you mix talent and work ethic in a system that's built customized for him, that's when you can see some cool results. Six days a week, they're doing double workouts. They'll come in before the court. They'll activate, get stretched out get on the court, do their court skill work, come in here, do their strength and power work. Like you're not ever taking a day off and not ever not working. The dudes that don't work is like the dudes that just hang around. It's tough, you know, they, they're grinding on the court and so we're pulling everything we can out of them. When I first started this, like day two, I think I was OD sore. Like, and we supposed to go run dunes or something. Like, I could not, no, not running dunes. <laughs> I was too sore. You start at the bottom, you work your way up, and that's what's like so intriguing to me. Like sixth grade, now you're the bottom. You got to work your way to eighth grade. Freshman, you got to work your way to the senior year, like varsity. College comes, you're a freshman, like pretty shitty, and then you gotta work your way up to being good. Same way with the pros, you're a rookie, like you can be cold as a rookie, or you can just be like an all right rookie. Hey. This whole journey was like, I'm determined to, to make it to the league. Like once my name gets called, like I'm determined to be a rookie of the year. We had some pre and post testing, so we were post testing them because they're about to start their, their team workouts. Now we're going with the approach. Okay, MJ. Hey. Oh. Hey. Oh. Oh. Nice job, man. That's that's a great improvement right there. With the no approach up to two inches, with the approach five and a half inches. I've been doing this 15 years. I've never seen numbers like that. I did it in two weeks. <laughs> Thinking, what can I do in three months? I need another goal. Like, I never lift the weights, but now that like I'm seeing a change in my body, like it goes back to breaking the barrier. Like never ending cycle of it. I have a unique situation. I'm not going to the league to score. I'm getting drafted because I can defend, you know, two through five, rebound and block shots and, and be an athletic dude. But if I had a jumper or, a, you know, a three, you make free throws and score the ball when you're throwing them, now that's a plus. You're on a, a path to be an all-star.